Why hello champions, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a, another Disney themed item. And if I show you this, you already know. So what are we waiting for? Let's get right into the video. So I have my hot glue gun right here. My rose. Let's go ahead and take that off and plug that in. So I have my rose. It's definitely going to be a little bit too big, but I've found a way to get around that. And I'm going to go ahead and cut the label off. I got this from Michael's, I think. Because I wasn't going to... Yeah, that day was crazy. So what we're going to go ahead and do is just take it off of the back. I'm hoping that I'm able to take that bit off. No, that sucks. Because I wanted to be able to get the leaves in it. Oh, I can. But, there we go. So now all I, you have to do is get that off. And then just pretty much size it until it's about the right size for your container. Mine I got from the dollar section at Target. And now I can put those leaves on. And voila. It is the perfect size to put back on there. But what I'm also going to do is measure out where it's, so yeah, we have to pull this leaf off and this leaf off. Unfortunately, it can't have any leaves. Uh, about right there. Let's see it with the rose on. I guess that's as far as it will go back. No, you've got to be able to go back all the way. And I've been watching the, watching, that's it for the rose. Okay, so it'd be right there. Wow, I'm, that is really short. If I can even cut it. Do I need pliers? No. I shouldn't need pliers. Doink. Yes. I will need pliers. And to remeasure it. Oh. These don't cut wire. Was it right here? There we go. Now that you've got your little rose, you can go ahead and start to hot glue it down in your 
stand and the base for mine is metal which the other one there was wood and I was so glad when they brought the brought them back because I wanted had been wanting to do this project but didn't get a chance to get the ones when they first put, got put out. So you're just gonna go ahead and take that, place it around in the cent somewhere around in the center, and just pretty much go around the stand. Build the base up a bit for the, with the hot glue on both sides now yes it will look a bit messy in the container which is why you want your hot glue to pretty much be the lighter of the colors So now that it's standing on its own, you're just gonna wanna pretty much make sure that it looks pretty clean with the glue. If you have to get a razor knife, go ahead and get a razor knife to just clean up the pieces. But other than that, you're pretty much good to go. What I wanna do now is check to see how it looks in the container so this is what it looks like in the container I'm not gonna do lights like you sometimes see on like Etsy and whatnot what I'm actually gonna do is cut up some of the petals that it came with and pretty much just round that out just putting some petals on the base just like one or two is fine because it the beast petals did were falling so now let's see how it looks first you can you just have to angle it a specific way and voila i feel very proud of how it looks. So I'm not gonna hot glue the petals down or the top to the base because if I have to change it, then I have to end up changing it, but I know I won't. But it's so cute and it definitely looks like the rose from Beauty and the Beast. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to a thumbs up in the section down below. Don't forget to comment down below any video ideas you want me to do. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye guys. Love you.